Hello, and welcome to the basics of the Harris Employee Stock Ownership Plan, or ESOP. Today we are going to discuss the fundamentals of the Harris ESOP so that you have an understanding of what it is, how it works, and how we as employee owners can impact our share price and build wealth from our work. Okay, let's do this. The Harris Employee Stock Ownership Plan, or ESOP, is a qualified long-term retirement plan for Harris employee owners to build money for their future. ESOPs are governed by a federal law called the Employee Retirement Income Security Act of 1974, or ERISA, which sets the rules for private industry pension and health plans. Long story short, it's additional free money Harris contributes to our individual retirements in addition to our salaries. Nice. How does it work, you ask? Let's take a look. The ESOP is held in a trust, and we as employee owners are participants in the ESOP trust. The trust is overseen by a trustee. It's their job to ensure the plan is managed fairly and in the best interests of the plan participants, us. The trustee has several other fiduciary responsibilities, including the oversight of our firm's valuation, performed by our independent appraiser, who determines the value of our firm and ultimately the Harris share price. The Harris board is beholden to the trust to ensure Harris is being governed properly and again, in the best interests of plan participants. Harris works with a third-party plan administrator to generate our participants' annual ESOP statements, calculate allocations, and pay out distributions. These partners contribute to our annual ESOP process. Let's take a quick look at what happens to the ESOP throughout the year. Beginning in Q1, we deliver an employee census to principal so everyone is accounted for, Harris's value is appraised, and our share price is determined. Remember, this only happens once a year. In Q2, Principal allocates shares to participants and the ESOP undergoes its annual audit. In Q3, ESOP participants receive their annual statements which reflects the value of their stock and cash. In Q4, if you are eligible to receive a distribution, Principal mails information to your home about how to request your distributions within a 30-day time frame. If you miss the window, you have to wait until next year. Now you may be asking yourself, what do I need to do to become a plan participant? Let's get into it. First, you must have completed one year of service with Harris and 1,000 hours within that time. That's it. Oh, and you get a nifty ESOP bucket symbolizing your new participant status and having something to put your bucks in. Like most retirement plans, there is a vesting schedule based on years of service. When you work six years, you are 100% vested and you not only receive 100% of the full value of your shares, but you get a cool vest to rep the Harris ESOP. The good news is, there are a bunch of ways we can perform our daily work to positively impact our company's value and ultimately our share price. The number one thing we can do is promote profitable growth for the company by having profitable projects and making sure we hit our utilization targets and effective multiplier, by closely monitoring our project's accounts receivables and work in progress to help cash flow, by controlling our overhead costs, by submitting our timesheets promptly to make timely informed decisions, by performing our client management duties to keep the opportunity pipeline strong, by expanding our resume of skills and certifications that clients need or want, and by hiring exceptional teammates. Congratulations, you made it through the basics of the Harris ESOP. You've learned about the Harris ESOP, how it works, how we can influence the value of our company through the work we do every day, and how we can control our destiny and translate our work into long-term retirement wealth. Thanks for joining us.